Hello, welcome back. Let me tell you about my Masai. Wait. So there's this place by me called Ubatuba and um, I really like their acai. It's like the only acai that I've had that I'm like, oh, this is really, really good. And then I found out that you can get trays and take them home. So I have this like huge tray and it lasts me weeks and it's just full of acai. So I let it fall for a second and then I just make this with blueberries, honey, honey. and granola. This is my favorite and I think it's my favorite because the granola is so good. I have four auditions this weekend. I did two today. I think I'm gonna do the other two tomorrow morning and do homework tonight. This outfit is so ugly. <laughs> these jeans, I like hate these jeans, but they're the only clean ones I have right now. And it's freezing outside, so I'm wearing a tank top with slides with a winter jacket. So <laughs> that makes no sense. I have to take Bugaboo to the vet for her second appointment. Her first general appointment was last week, or three weeks ago, so I have to take her now. Got the coffee. Hello. Hi. So Bug just got a bath because she smelled so bad. Also, no need to worry because I have her wrapped in like 100 layers and the heat is on very high. So don't come for my throat about kittens and warmth. I'm really crazy about that, about keeping her warm always. It's time to clean out the closet. I've been waiting for this day for ever. Every time I walk into my closet, I just want to burn the whole thing down. I'm just so disappointed by it. I'm like, what? What are you doing? Why are you here? Why do you exist? You're a failure and I need to burn you so I can fill you up with goodness, not whatever this is. It is time. Here we go. Because I decided to clean out my closet, I shouldn't swing these around, I thought it would be a really cool idea to sell the clothes I want to get rid of on ThreadUp. I have worked with ThreadUp before. I love ThreadUp. I think they offer amazing pieces and they're such an amazing company. And I love what they do because um, sustainability is incredibly important and they are literally giving clothes that people don't want anymore a chance to have a new life. They are reborn. Good for them. So, I am so excited to partner with ThreadUp on this video because you all are going to get to shop my closet yourself. 75 pieces, all for you. I'm scared, but this is it. Here we go. So I earlier said that I wanted to burn my closet and that's because I'm dramatic. So I don't want to burn it. I actually love my clothes a lot. I'm just overwhelmed because I have so many clothes I don't wear anymore. So I just want to declutter my life before the new year starts. And because I love th uh, Thread Up and I think they're such an amazing thrift store, I wanted to partner with them so they could help me give you all my clothes so that all these beautiful clothes can have a new life because they deserve it. This is the first item I'm getting rid of. Selling, I should say. I love it, very cute, very comfortable. Uh, lots of great ways you can style this. It's just not me anymore. I don't know, I like, sometimes I look at my clothes and I'm like, you could make this work if you really wanted to, but I think I just haven't had like a complete wardrobe clean out ever. I also wanted to show you a few other pieces I was gonna put on the website so you can kind of get like, a glimpse of what you can go shop. So this first dress is, I actually got it at this like small boutique shop in San Diego or something. So I was really obsessed with like mid length dresses at the time, but it's really cute for summer. This is a great just like throw on and be comfortable. You can style it up, you can style it down. It's a great dress. So I got this little set which is absolutely to die for. I'm obsessed with it. It's from Zara and uh, I love the color of it. I love the style. It's very, I feel like it's very in right now. It'll be great for summer next year. 
obviously it's very cold right now, it's winter, so you can grab this and wear it next summer. Another thing that I will be selling, that I will be selling, I don't know how to do a British accent, this dress. So I wore this out, I have a very specific memory for you. I wore this out to mat to dinner at like Mastro's and Catch a lot. This dress is also from Zara. It's very cute and I loved, so it's very frilly as you see and like very um, feminine. So I loved pairing it with combat boots. I thought it was really fun. Another thing I'm selling on my page is this adorable jumpsuit. Kushni. From Kushni. Um, a, oh, ach. I should know, but I don't, it's okay. And look at how cute this bow is in the back. I actually wore this to the Ghostbusters premiere a couple of years ago. I outgrew it, it like fits kind of awkward on me now, like it's way too high in the pants, in the crotch, it all just looks weird on me. But I really wish it still fit because I love it. I wish all of the things I'm selling still fit and I still like them because I love them and they're really cute, but now they can be yours. See, this, is quite literally my problem and why I haven't done this yet because every day I come in here to get dressed and I'm like looking through and I'm like no I don't want to wear any of this now I'm like going through so I can like get rid of some stuff and I'm like I don't want to get rid of that what if I wear it one day I haven't worn it in like five years when are you going to wear it Chloe why would you keep it no I'm getting rid of it that's it I'm getting rid of it I haven't worn it no this is cute I am very sad to part with all of these beautiful clothes, but at least they're getting a second life with all of you. So that's very reassuring. Uh, so you wanna go check out my closet before it sells out, before all the items are gone. Go to threadup.com slash Chloe to check it out and get 30% off of your first order. Give my clothes some love for me. Dropping it off now. Was it blocked? Yes. Oh. I thought I'd give you a mini haul because I haven't never done a haul. Well, in forever at least. And um, I did spend some money at the mall today. Not my money, my parents' money because they offered and I forgot my wallet. Okay, I'll show you what I got. Because why not? So I got a little silk turban. I've always wanted to use one of these. It's for when you sleep so your hair stays. Wait, where? Yeah. So your hair, where is it? So your hair um, doesn't like break. And I don't have a silk pillowcase here and that's very important so I got this one. And then I'm just gonna take it back because I do need more silk pillowcases in LA. I got sunscreen. My favorite sunscreen, this is Unseen Sunscreen by Supergoop. Unseen is the best because I used to use glow screen and it made me really dewy which is great but I already have oily skin so I like to use the Unseen because it's very matte, velvety feeling. I thought Claire stole it and I was about to get very upset. Oh, I decided recently I'm not going to get my nails done for a while. I just, I really like natural nails and I also like painting my own nails because I like changing the color often. So I got a new nail polish from Chanel at Nordstrom. I got this cheek and lip tint from Kalia. Is that how you pronounce it? I got this really cool thing from YSL. So my skin gets red really easily, so I got the green one. So since I'm trying to do less coverage, I figure instead of doing like a full face of foundation, I can just use this green to cover up my red marks because that's what I use the foundation, like the concealer for anyway. So I'll just use this to cover the red marks. That way I don't have to use as much coverage. And then I just use this little cheek tint to go. And then it's all good. Oh my God. She stole my lip oil. And I'm gonna go get it, cause she keeps stealing my things. But I got this um, red lipstick from YSL because I was seeing a lot of influencers post about this, like about YSL lipstick and it got me. I went and got the red one, so it works. <laughs> we... 
<laughs> Did you see Clara? No, I saw you. I was like looking at her to like say something and she went, well, because I was pausing my music. Uh, we're going to our grandparents' house right now. The whole family's there, all the cousins and everything. Right, I'm more Polish than Russian, but you're just latching on to Russian. <laughs> no. I'm Slovakian and Hungarian. So, I, my, this family has never been very like rooted in culture or like traditions or anything. But like a couple of years ago, we all did the ancestry test. Well, can I and my phone? our last name is Polish. Lukasiak is Polish, but we did the ancestry test and sort of figured out what we all are. And now I'm obsessed with it because I finally feel part of something. I finally feel <laughs> You're so weird. Like I have, I have a reason bigger than myself. Chloe, you were baptized in that church. Do you feel part of it? No. How is it not cool? That's cool. Yeah, that's fine. Thank you. Enjoy. Barnes came. Barnes, hi. He came with us. He's busy driving. So that brings us to the conclusion of my little random vlog. Thank you as always for watching. Don't forget, you can click the link below to shop my closet with ThreadUp. Go do it before everything sells out or you can go to threadup.com slash Chloe to check out the items and get an extra 30% off of your first order. So thank you and go shop away and I'll see you all soon. Bye.